I used to eat. I don't even know what I'm saying. It's okay, we like to. Ow! Oh! Feet. This doesn't go in the fridge. I just wanna be happy. Happy tonight. guys <clears throat> oh my throat welcome to the video today is <laughs> gonna be a little day in the life full day of eating bits and bobs because I really need to get back on the YouTube train so join me in a boring day of my life let's go now see I is, can you focus on my face please thank you I tell everyone this my protein oats are the best in the world. I've tried multiple proteins. I've tried different ways of cooking it. But this, this is always the number one way. <laughs> so I've just got half a cup of oats, a tablespoon and a bit of Tropica lean protein. The best. I have a discount code. Um, I'm not sure if it's still going to be working by the time I post this but I'll put it on the screen anyway so give it a go if it works fabulous if it doesn't um, I'm deeply sorry I'm sure you can find someone some another one elsewhere also if you have banana in your oats and you've never added it while it's cooking so it like kind of melts and cooks with the oats you're missing out because it honestly changed my life. <laughs> it changed the protein oats game for me. 10 times better. The Tropica protein on its own isn't very sweet. And so melting the banana with the oats, it sort of just infuses that sweetness and makes it nice and sweet. Wooden spoons, because when you stir, they don't scratch the pot. Chef Summer over here giving you all the tips. Also, my shirt. Dregs, little plug, Australian duo. They're awesome. Oh, for time reference, it's currently 8 a.m. Usually, if I have a day off, I will have breakfast a little bit later because I'll go train first thing in the morning but today I did wake up at my usual time and I accidentally fell back asleep which is fine because clearly my body needed the extra rest so that's all right day's a little bit different today that's okay we like to ow oh <laughs> what I was gonna say <laughs> we like to spice things up every now and then yeah, anyway, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Can you say hi to the camera? Look at my cute dog. He's so done with me. Sorry to disturb you. Ooh, she's bubbling. I just love cooking, hey? Now I'm going to add some cinnamon. Just a little bit. This is the best part of my day. If your oats don't bring you pure joy, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> this is always a struggle. Ooh. All right, today's agenda. Eat breakfast, do some work, go train, grocery shopping, maybe a little bit more work, see how I feel, and then chill time. This is probably just gonna end up being a full day of eating because I'm not really doing anything that interesting. We'll see. Life is full of endless possibilities. You never know what the day is going to bring. So hopefully something interesting happens today. We'll see. So I went to the coast like a couple weeks ago and I got to the gym. I'm like ready to smash out a great workout. Pull my AirPods in and it goes doo doo. And I'm like, excuse me and one of my airpods didn't charge and it was in the case the charging case and it didn't charge and i was like 
I'm in an unfamiliar gym. I mean, I've been there a few times. Like, I know kind of where everything is, so it wasn't completely unfamiliar. But I was like, I really needed those beats today. <laughs> and so I had to listen to music in one ear, which if you've ever had to do that, it's really unbalancing, disorientating. I don't know, but you feel a bit weird, you know. But how does that even happen? Like, they were in there properly. I don't know. Airpods were hating on me that day. But it's fine. It's fine. Anyway, back to work. Hardest decision of the day. Deciding what to wear to the gym. Alrighty, gangling. It's time for the gym. Having a little... Pre-workout snack. Oops. All right, pre-workout snack. <laughs> Get those quick carbs in. Mm. My love cereal just hits different, you know. Are you team soggy cereal? Or crunchy cereal. Personally, I like a bit of bit of both. Mostly crunchy though. We are going to take some pre. Now, whether I have pre or not just depends how I feel. I don't have it every day. I do also have a non-stim pre-workout, so no caffeine for the days that I train a little bit later. I mean, I feel like to be fair, caffeine really doesn't affect me that much in terms of like, I feel like I, I'm quite a high energy person as is, so I don't really need it, but I do find if I have it after like 12 p.m., it takes me ages to fall asleep as is, but if I have caffeine at like 1 p.m., I will not fall asleep for like hours after I try to go to bed. And that's just, just how it be. This doesn't go in the fridge. <laughs> Got my creatine and there's like half a scoop left of my Oxy Shred from EHP Labs. This is in watermelon candy. Not my fave, to be honest. The only reason I bought it originally was because it was like half price. So, you know, you gotta pick up the deals. Oh, this is literally like half a scoop. That's all right. And I just spilt half of it on the bench. That's cool. So difficult to get the last bit out. Should I put water in that and like... Yeah, let's do it, hey. Oh, she's really sweet, this one. <laughs> Every cent counts, right? Take this with me in the car. I'll see you at the gym. All right, gang, we're hyped up, ready to go. And look at this, a gift. It's good luck, right? I'm gonna say it is. Even though the bird didn't poo on me, it Put on Shazza here. Maybe Shazza's in for some good luck. For some good luck with our cars. I wouldn't mind an upgrade. Love you, but we're getting on. <laughs> I want a 4B. All right, anyway, leg sesh is about to go down. We're in for some squatties today. <laughs> Let's get it. All right, to kick off this workout, I started with 10 minute steady incline walk on the treadmill just to get the blood flowing. And now I'm just going through some hip opener exercises. Because first up, I am squatting. So these exercises just help open the hips and improve my range of motion so I can get the best out of the movement. A few key things I like to focus on when I'm squatting is making sure I'm breathing correctly. So taking a breath, bracing, performing the eccentric phase of the squat. So that's going down and then exhaling as I push the weight back up. 
I also focus on spreading the floor with my feet. So making sure my big toe, little toe and heel are pressed firmly into the ground and my knees are pushing outwards. You also notice that I have taken my shoes off. For the same reason, it's recommended to squat with flatter shoes. Squatting barefoot helps with stability and maintaining good form throughout the lift. I find it a lot more comfortable personally and no shoes means I can really grip the floor and form a stable base for my squat, which is very important. Next up, we have the glorious hack squat. I have a love-hate relationship with this thing. If you're looking to absolutely murder your quads, throw this in after your squats. It is brutal. <laughs> um, as you can see, it's written all over my face. After that, I moved on to the G80 hip thrust machine. I recently swapped my regular barbell hip thrust out for these just to try something new and oh my gosh, I love this thing. It's super quick to set up and I find it really helps with reaching the full extension of the hips, which sometimes if you're doing heavy hip thrusts, you may not reach. And this top portion of the lift is the most effective part of the lift. Uh, so this thing is great. It also makes it a lot easier to control the weight on the eccentric part of the movement. Hot tip, if you want the best pump ever on your final set, finish your highest weight with however many reps you're doing, then drop your weight by like 50% and just rep it out as many as you can. As you can see in the clip, I'm just focusing on that top part of the motion. So it's more of a partial rep than a full rep and oh my gosh, it burns. <laughs> Moved on to some walking lunges. I only did a couple sets of these because I had to go like way heavier in these than I normally would because the kettlebells that I needed weren't there. So <laughs> I was really hating life here. Okay, tripod's having a moment. Ah, gym sesh done. I actually filmed. I'm so proud of myself. I've had a bit of anxiety with filming. It's just one of those things, you know, like you can get in your head a little bit about it, especially like filming. You don't want to get people in it who don't want to be in it. It's just, it's a bit stressful, but I did it and I'm so proud of myself. Unfortunately, I couldn't film my whole workout because it did get super busy, like halfway, three quarters into my workout. Stomach is grumbling. Let us go do the groceries and I'll see you at home. Just adulting things. Again. Oh. Grocery haul time. All right. Two bags of goodies. That's probably the most expensive shop I've done in a while, but it's all right. <laughs> Capsicums, carrots, straws. They're in special at the moment. Mm. It's fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. <I'm> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, oh, okay. <laughs> Tomatoes, <laughs> bananas, almond milk, avo, protein yogurt, <laughs> bread, coleslaw mix, oats because I was running low, noodles, taco seasoning, some chalky. And deodorant because I ran out and I was very smelly in the gym today. But yes, there you go. That's a, a good assortment of items. A little appetizer. Alright, here's lunch. It's just sweet chili noodles with 
coleslaw mix, carrot and chicken. If you're someone with a big appetite, like myself, this is a great meal to have. Super high volume, so it keeps you fuller for longer. It's so funny because like in recent years we've had to invest in bigger bowls and dishes because <laughs> my meals stopped fitting in the ones we had. <laughs> So good. Now for today's purpose because I was coming from the gym and I was starving so I wanted to make something super quick. I just bought the like pre-prepped coleslaw. This is actually two serves. I just put the whole lot in because like why not? <laughs> I do try not to use this as much because of all the single use plastic. And so if I don't have this I'll usually just put in Capsicum and grated carrot. Let's dig in. Got myself a little Arvo snack. Just having two pieces of whole grain toast with peanut butter. Dude, my glutes. <laughs> How good is bread though? Getting peanut butter sandwiches for school in primary school those were the days hey i have been sitting for literally wow almost three hours i need to move oh oh, ah, ah, ah. oh my quad just started cramping okay we're good oh that would have been bad yeah basically no point recording the last three hours because i was just sitting at my computer doing work. I just created a new banner. Ah, oh. oh, okay. I really need to walk around. It's fine. It's fine. It took me so long because I'm so indecisive when it comes to my creative decisions. So it took me a while, but let me show you. I mean, you'll see it if you're on my channel anyway, but this is what we're looking at. Cute. Yeah, I'm about to go make my dinner. And then I think we're watching the new Game of Thrones series or spin off. It's the Targaryen spin off thingy um, with my fam. Uh, I'm scared to get up because my leg is going to cramp. Okay, let's do it. We're all right. <laughs> okay, I'm not making dinner yet. I got distracted. I'm just like watching back on my last video and I'm just like, I feel like I've changed so much in the past, uh, what has it been? Five months. <laughs> so my last video I posted on the 31st of March and we are now almost at the end of August. Look. I'm now dedicated to posting more, but yeah, I don't know. I just feel like, <laughs> like I'm not gonna lie. I've been through a lot in the past six months. I suppose it's not even on my face. And I just feel like a different person. Obviously like I'm the same in a lot of ways, but I've also really grown and yeah, like I'm excited for what the future holds. I'm getting a little deep. I'm just, I'm loving this constant growth kind of, kind of deal. Oh my gosh, my butt. Okay, enough chitter chatter. I'm gonna go make my dinner for real this time. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. Tomorrow's gonna be a good day. Chicken burrito bowl. Look at all those colors. <laughs> My clock is just like kind of squashed to the side there because I couldn't see the point in mashing it in another bowl. So before, after. Last meal of the day. It's just protein yogurt, chocolate and strawberries. I am going to enjoy this 
and then I'm basically just gonna get ready for bed so I'm going to end the vlog here thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed and if you made it to the end leave a comment telling me what you want to see next for real though like if you made it to the end of the video thank you so much I appreciate that I know that nowadays a lot of us our attention spans they're not that great but yeah, I hope I kept you engaged enough to make it to the end. Like, subscribe, check out my Instagram, and I hope you have an amazing day. <laughs> See you in the next one.